Hey, welcome back on this Friday morning. We are in for a gorgeous day and that continues for Saturday and Sunday. We're looking at some sunshine mixed in with clouds for today. A west wind though and more of a southwest wind by late in the day will likely become breezy. So we'll likely see some winds gusting anywhere from 25 to near 35 miles per hour, depending on where you're located at. The gusty conditions near Lake Superior. But on the bright side, temperatures are going to be above normal into the 50s for most areas today. Here's the break down some lower 50s to the tip of the Keweenaw and then elsewhere we're looking at mid to upper 50s with likely seeing a few low 60s along the Wisconsin state line and in some of our southern counties. So that's putting us well above normal for this time of year. We're supposed to be in the upper 40s for this time of year. As we head towards tomorrow, conditions are going to be great to do any fall activities, Halloween activities. If you haven't had a chance to carve your pumpkins, this weekend's going to be a good one for it as well. Tomorrow looks good. Some sunshine and a few clouds out there, but mostly sunny skies expected with temperatures into the 60s. Check it out for tomorrow afternoon. A lot of areas in the western counties will push mid to upper 60s for the afternoon hours in similar conditions expected on Sunday. Even potentially a few 70 degree readings in some isolated locations Sunday afternoon and again on Monday afternoon. So definitely going to see a bit of a warmer stretch here over the coming days. Here's your hour by hour. There is going to be a band of clouds that rolls in this afternoon. So we'll start to see some cloud cover bump up briefly this afternoon. That quickly moves on through. That's associated with a weak little front that's moving through the area. Not much with any moisture associated with it. As we head towards tomorrow, we're looking at mostly sunny skies and plenty of sunshine as we head into Sunday as well. So things are looking good. At this moment, this is the setup and what we have going on. Here's that little small wave of energy, the little trough or front that's just to our west that's going to move in today with no moisture. But we're looking ahead to this one that's developing off in the Pacific Northwest. That comes in for Sunday night and into Monday. It's going to bring in a couple rounds of some showers, maybe some isolated thunder showers starting Sunday night all the way through Wednesday and it's also going to bring in some windy conditions on Monday. So here's the preview of this upcoming Monday. Windy conditions as that area of low pressure lifts north will start off Monday morning with some scattered rain showers and then we kind of catch a break for the afternoon as we head towards Tuesday. We'll have similar conditions. That cold front will be moving right over us so we're going to have some scattered rain showers roll through for Tuesday morning and then move out and then on Wednesday we'll have some rain showers lingering in the eastern half of the the UP. When we come back, how have home sales done over the past month?